Um, just before we break into our small groups, uh, I felt the need to share uh, some scripture so that we are fed this week um, and maybe something we can meditate on before we go into our small groups. Just a brief word from the scripture. This is from uh, Genesis uh, chapter 4. The situation is with the two brothers, Cain and Abel. I was reminded of the scripture as I watched my my two sons interact this week. Um, The older one is two and a half, and his will is growing day by day, and uh, his desires and uh, his character are becoming more evident, and not only his good parts, but the evil parts as well. Um, He is a sinner, and he needs Jesus just as much as we do. So this is uh, reminding me of that. But the situation is Cain and Abel in Genesis chapter 4. Cain is jealous of his brother Abel, and the jealousy becomes anger. And the anger is growing out of control. And God is so kind that before the anger masters Cain, God gives Cain a warning. And he says, Cain, if you're not careful, this anger will control you and you will be miserable. Um, This is what he says. Uh, Read with me in chapter, uh, excuse me, chapter 4, verse 6. The Lord said to Cain, Why are you angry? Why is your face downcast. If you do what is right, will you not be accepted? But if you do not do what is right, sin is crouching at your door. It desires to have you, but you must master it. Uh, The first two things God asks, God does to Cain is asks him, why are you angry? God knows the answer. But Cain, God wants Cain to ask himself, why am I angry? What is the real reason for my anger? That's so important because uh, anger is, is the doorway to our sin, very much so. If we have trouble uh, with sin, with a, ha- habit, a, a habitual sin, or a sudden sin, or an uncontrollable sin, something evil in our life that we just can't seem to get rid of. of. Take a look at your anger. Why are you angry? What is the cause of that? Do you seek revenge? Are you unforgiving? Um, Has someone hurt you so bad that you can only be angry to uh, compensate for the pain? Why are you angry? God asks Cain. And why is your face downcast? Cain was not just angry, but he was depressed. Depression and anger are very much related. I'm not a psychologist, psychiatrist, but even I know that when I get angry, it's easy for me to go into a downward spiral, downward a spin into depression. Uh, I experienced that even a couple weeks ago in the Philippines. Got angry, and now I'm downcast. Why, God asks us. And then here's the key that God gives to Cain. Sin is crouching at your door. Sin is waiting. Sin finds the anger and says, that's my way into your heart. And if you can't get rid of your, your anger, you're going to have a difficult time getting rid of your sin. Oh God, search me, try me, know my heart. See if there's any wicked way in me, says David in Psalm 139. Look inside me, God, and show me where my anger is so that I can confess it and so that I can get rid of this sin. I can get rid of this bitterness. Why am I angry, Lord? And give it to Jesus. Give it to God. 
God says, my peace, I, Jesus said, my peace I give to you, not as the world gives, but as I give. That's Jesus saying that. Jesus gives us a kind of peace that no one else, that no uh, material possession, that no career, that no status will ever give us. There is a peace that we only can find in Jesus Christ because he is the Prince of Peace. And the cross is what uh, gives us access to his peace. So if you have this anger or this habitual sin, go to the cross. Go to Jesus Christ. Receive his peace. Receive his forgiveness. That's just a short word from the Lord. Um, but if you do not do what is right, sin is crouching at your door. It desires to have you, but you must master it. Lord, help us. Show us our anger. Help us to receive it, your, your forgiveness. Okay, let's take some time now to break up into groups of four or five. We'll ask the women to group, uh, break up here and the men to break up here. Uh, the Japanese expression is tekito, tekito de i. Okay, you just do, you know, just, um, I don't even know how to say it in English. Just play it by ear, I guess. Uh, the men are on this side, the women are here. Take time to share with each other and then pray. Make sure you pray at the end. We'll finish around 3. If you go over time, it's okay. But aim for about 3 o'clock. Let's go ahead and break into small groups. <laughs>